taking a look at Tropical Storm Ari, something that the folks along the East Coast are watching much, much closer over the last couple of days as the model tendency has been bringing it closer to New England. Now at the moment, battling wind shear does look like we're going to see this become a hurricane as it approaches kind of the Massachusetts. Uh, Rhode Island area as we get into late Sunday and then early Monday finally started to move out, but it could be a hurricane if it is able to make landfall in New England. Either way, it does look like it's going to impact the New England states. And here is Tropical Storm Grace back over open water. We will likely see this start to reorganize a bit, get better developed and become a hurricane right before landfall. Now what I mentioned, what's kind of interesting is that some of the models pick up on this actually redeveloping in the eastern Pacific. Matter of fact, right now the percent chance of it developing once in the Pacific is up to 70%, but it would not still be Grace. Grace is an Atlantic name. If it was in the eastern Pacific, the next name on that list is Marty. So we've got two separate lists. We've got one for the Atlantic Basin and one for the East Pacific, everything that forms west of Mexico. Our forecast, though, we're not worrying about the tropics. High temperatures into the upper 90s, heat indices well above 110. And then as we get into next week, perhaps a few showers to help knock those temperatures into the more low to mid 90s.